And uh, here I'd like to ask uh, Jeje, as the CEO of Vivo, I'm sure uh, that you have a lot of experience in, in the way that AI can help the, the financial industry. So I'd like to have your view on uh, how AI can help financial advisors perform better in the future. With pleasure. And perhaps I'll start by um, taking a line out of Andreas's conclusion. I believe that artificial intelligence is there not to replace human agency or human capability, but to augment it. In other words, to create new social goods and social benefits that help us thrive as a society. And the moment you frame AI as an enabler rather than a threat, the entire business landscape changes. And so to your question, Fotis, specifically, you know, relating to how AI can entirely enable or re-enable the financial services and fintech sector um, to increase. Well, what we've seen in our operations, principally in the UK, but also through Northern and Central Europe, is that AI typically provides three very critical benefits. The first one is uh, automation. So we've seen a lot of efficiency improvements done simply because certain processes, often done by human, are prone to error, fatigue, and as we know through a pandemic, often burnout, right? So when you automate those processes, you create a new level of capability that before that the organization did not have. And through machine learning, AI is continuously learning how to perform tasks better and better over time. So here there is a similarity to the way that we develop as humans, right? Cognitively, we become better over time. The second key advantage that AI provides in the industry is consistency. The idea of following a work or rule pattern within parameters, but it also talks to these key concepts of precision, right? Consistency, effective reporting, both to the regulator and the consumer and internally to the organization. And this is critical focus because in an era where you have so much compliance obligations, consistency and efficiency do not simply become a matter of competitiveness, but they become a matter of survival, at least on a legal basis. And I think the third key advantage that I'll speak of today is when AI provides that level of speed right, in processing, which prevents risk. So with the ability that AI has to aggregate massive libraries of information, of data points, AI can typically very quickly answer questions, problems, requirements that otherwise would require very um, time and labor intensive activity. Now, when you introduce an enabler like that into your business, you create so many opportunities to reduce risk that, for example, in the financial services sector, we have so many transactions, users can typically ask or query or verify a transaction and see whether it is compliant even before execution because we can you know predict what the likely outcome is by modeling it and that avoids a lot of non-compliance issues which exist in the world without um, AI. So this is an area where fintech workers are breathless. They're trying to keep up pace with regulation. There are so many requirements for efficiency. And so it's so lovely to see that artificial intelligence can be a catalyst, a positive change in an industry that's ready for it.